Discovery of Auxin Auxin was the first plant hormone isolated, and it is probably the most thoroughly studied of all plant growth regulators. Many generations of plant scientists have contributed to our understanding of how auxin works. In the late 19th and early 20th centuries, a series of elegant experiments into the nature of shoot phototropism, moving toward light, led directly to the identification of auxin as a mobile signal regulating cell elongation. Charles Darwin and his son Francis studied phototropism in coleoptiles, a tissue in monocots that protects young leaves during germination. In 1880, they determined that light given from one side is perceived at the coleoptile tip but that, some influence is transmitted from the upper to the lower part, causing the latter to bend. From experiments on coleoptile phototropism, Darwin concluded in 1880 that a growth stimulus is produced in the coleoptile tip and is transmitted to the growth zone. In 1913, Peter Boys and Jensen furthered these studies, observing in that the influence can move through an agar block but not a solid substance. He separated the tip from the remainder of the coleoptile by a cube of gelatin which prevented cellular contact but allowed chemicals to pass through. The seedlings responded normally bending towards the light. However, when the tip was separated by an impermeable substance, a mica plate then there was no curvature form. Arpad Palt 1919 showed that removing the tip of a dark-grown coleoptile and replacing the tip asymmetrically onto the coleoptile base could induce curvature in the absence of a light stimulus. Fritz Wendt placed coleoptile tips onto agar blocks and showed that these treated blocks were capable of promoting growth, they had captured the growth-promoting substance. Wendt's experiments led to the purification and identification of the auxin in dole-3-acetic acid, IAA. In 1926, Wendt showed that the active growth-promoting substance can diffuse into a gelatin block. He also devised a coleoptile bending assay for quantitative auxin analysis.